What's up, guys? So I'm going to react to uh, her video. I've reacted to her videos before. Go back and look. Months ago. So here we go. Let's react to this one. Yes, hello. If you are going through a divorce right now and you have kids with a woman, this is your reminder to always remain respectful. Your kids are looking up to you, and this situation, it needs a hero. Who better to be a hero than you? Yes, hello. If See, the thing is with this, this usually ends bad for most guys. Uh, when it comes to the divorce, you're automatically, almost automatically going to lose your kids. If you're a guy. Like, that's almost an automatic. Which is pretty stupid. Like, you should have a chance to prove that you're the better parent than the mother. You should have that chance. You should have that opportunity. Now, with me and my ex-wife, we didn't have to fight that because we could communicate still. So, uh, we did what was best for our son. I get him every other weekend. But I usually have him when... I can have him whenever I want him, though. Like, all I got to do is say, can I get my son today? And she'll let me have him. A lot of relationships don't work that way. They don't work that way at all. They work... You're not getting your damn son till it's your freaking weekend. And then they want to bitch and complain once you come get your son for the weekend. Or your daughter. I've been down that road. With my daughter. Up until she was three. Now I, like I've had her since she was three. So. Uh, but up until she was three. I kind of went down that road. So I know what it's like. So yes. You can be the good person. That doesn't mean you're going to end up on the good side. Because This. Divorce shit with your kids usually ends bad for the guy. Almost, a, what, almost 80 or 90% of the time? But I get what she's saying. She's saying, be the better person because it might help you in the end.